so uh, this is probably the one of the craziest turnaround projects I've ever done. It's called Teak on the Hudson. Jeff, the man meat bartender, is uh, filming. Manager, <laughs> bartender. So you can see we're uh, Teak here, right on the other side. Zoom the camera around, you can see the uh, New York skyline off there. That's uh, Manhattan right there. Great location, right across from the path in Hoboken, New Jersey. Let's uh, go ahead and come on inside, take a look real quick. So when I got here, a few of the issues that they had was there was no energy. They had uh, very limited high energy points. So when we got here, First thing I did is I uh, moved the host to stand around. Second thing we did is we added high top tables. Then I came in and added two mega P6 high resolution 15 foot diagonal LED walls. So as you can see, I've always got one masculine channel, one feminine channel. I've always got the food channel on one, sports channel on the other one. Keeps that good for guys and girls. During the daytime, the up upstairs sound system, you can hear the audio of the sports channel, while the downstairs, you've got the ambient vibe from uh, Wii's Disclosure. Come on in, that's off of Pan Pandora. We've got Nico in the house. Say what's up, Nico. What's up? All right. We've got an amazing 44 foot, it's like 40 foot fish tank. All right. The fish actually should have their own little Instagram and Twitter accounts. It's absolutely amazing. So we've begun to transform the entire venue. Came in here and during nightclub, we put up the curtains, put up a complete, move the entire sound system around, move the uh, audio system around, move the, install a complete new light system. Take a look over there. We've uh, put in a temporary DJ booth. We're eventually gonna build that out to be permanent. We're probably gonna move it over one section, put the seating back over to the left right there, and then uh, put the DJ booth over in the middle. Right now, what happens is, it come for our turnaround at 10 o'clock, the curtains close all the way around the, uh, dan the dining room, it comes to the dance floor. We clear everything out that allows us to not uh, bother other diners, other people that are coming in. It also encloses the room down, so people feel like they're not in this giant space, so we get crazy busy packed inside this area right here. And then come 10:30, 11 o'clock, we start to open all the curtains up. The whole dining room floor has been transformed into VIP sections. It's uh, it's an amazing transformation. That's it. The office is Jason. Say hi, Jason. Hi, Jason. Welcome to Teak. Perfect. So uh, we're just sitting here. Jason's pulling up all our numbers for uh, last year, year over year, and you can see that uh, we're now going into almost three months of our turnaround project at Teak. You can clearly see here's the 2013 numbers, here's the 2014 numbers. We've been pulling week over week reports. You can see that uh, we're up for this last week, a little low, almost just a hair under 18,000 over last year. We've really improved the sales, got the operation running smoothly. Uh, in June, I want to say the end of, uh, end of July, we were up uh, probably about 60, what was it, 57,000? How much were we up that last month? Uh, Man. Oh, too many numbers in my head. It, it was a lot. We were definitely up uh, probably 50 grand. Yeah, so we were, we're way up. I've got those numbers. I'll put those on video also to show you how much higher. But this is what Jason has to work with. This is the... This is it. <laughs> it's the cave. The cave. That's right. With uh, Chelsea. Most yes. amazing server in the whole wide world. Josh. Most amazing, yeah. amazing bartender in the whole wide world. Yeah. 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 Somewhat, what somewhat. What do you think, Chelsea? Yeah. Yeah. like to be yeah. more amazing. Yeah, a little more amazing, maybe when he grows up. Yeah. So uh, our group has been here for almost three months now. So just tell us a little bit about uh, Teak before we got here. Oh, crazy, unorganized, hectic, horrible. Pretty much all of the above. Not uh, fun. Yeah, no structure, Sad. no structure. Yeah. So now that we've got here, and uh, what are a couple of things that, in your mind, are some of the most things that you've been taken with or impressed with that our group has done? Um, the business. I've definitely seen a big improvement in the business, the quality of people, the quality of food that we're running, uh, the quality and service has gotten up, more help. organized. The help of managers, management, yeah. uh, and the hierarchy of Teak is actually coming down and helping. Now we have a structure to follow. It's not everyone for themselves. It's more of a team effort. 
How about some of the training programs that we've put together and done with you guys? Fun. Oh yeah. <laughs> Very entertaining. <laughs> Let's get a blindfold <laughs> right now. <laughs> Do a little recap. That was fun. Yeah. It's good. Oh it's, yeah. It's showing that we can have fun at work and you know still and be make professional, money. make money. You said six months and it's uh, it's, it's about that time and it's getting there. Okay. It's almost there. Three months. It's been <laughs> a long three months. It has. Yep. So a couple of things that we worked on. Uh, the main things we focus when we get here is what the customer can see touch and taste you know you guys are at the front you know you guys are out there during the whole you know the experience for the customers what are the couple things that you guys feel about what is the what are you what are you hearing from customers about the change uh, well, for the restaurant portion for the, uh, definitely the food the food is definitely uh, it's, it's getting more it's like kind of getting their attention a little bit more especially with the deals we're offering now I mean the half off was always there but the $20 is giving them a little bit more of a variety uh, so now they're coming in and they, they have something to pick from, they're grateful, uh, and they like the vibe. The scene, I mean, yeah, it's yeah. pretty much like... The service is better. Yeah, okay, yeah. What about the changes, the video screens and everything that we've done? Bring in so many people and they love it. They love that the atmosphere, they love the surround sound. Yeah. I'm looking forward to it. Everyone's talking about football season, so... There's times where I've um, been walking down the street and I hear people say, Oh, that's Teak, that's Teak. And that makes me feel pretty cool. Like, it makes me feel yeah. proud that I work there. The fact that people are talking about teak like that, I'm like that's teak. Let's go there. Okay, so let's talk about nightclub now. Woo! The best shit in the world. Yeah. It's like it's like fall of last year in the summer. It's awesome. Uh, I just can't wait for this fall. Once Tell us starts, a little bit about how it was before we got here. Uh, slow. Um, definitely. Uh, what, what can I say? I mean, too many bartenders on at once. So the place didn't look busy. I mean, now it's actually like a nightclub. You go to Pasha, you see the lights, you see dancers, you see like the mm -hmm. curtains and all that kind of stuff. And that's like a small town, uh, uh, a club in New York. Uh, and you come to Jersey now and you have Teak and Hudson in Hoboken where there's like Boa or Rain, whatever it's going to be in like Texas, Arizona. And then you have us. It's like an actual nightclub with awesome DJs, three rooms. Uh, eventually, what you said, they're going to be all uh, soundproof. That's going to be pretty cool. Yeah, that's cool. It's just all growing. It's us just go, only going busier, straight up. How much busier are we now here than they were before? Well, we had like 10 stacks on a Friday night in the summer. That's incredible. Yeah, that's, that's like... crazy. The <laughs> slowest season is the busiest. So, yeah. That's so far. Exactly, yeah. Because I started bartending at the middle when this was all kind of uh, like peaking and then going back down. So I saw uh, the high in the end, and now I see like we're at the high where we're supposed to be at the end, which is awesome. Okay. Shell, thanks, you guys. Yeah.